what's going on you guys now if you follow my um, ice cream van channel and you have the notifications on you would have just seen guys that about half an hour ago I uploaded a video of me having a autism meltdown and oh my god guys that guys has got to be the biggest autism meltdown I have had since I was diagnosed with autism back when I was three years old in 2006 guys I've had autism for nearly 13 years now it's going to be 13 years in September and that is the biggest one I have had yet and Adrian I am fine dude you don't have to worry about me I am just I am just like so shocked because that that is like the biggest one I've had in 12 and a half years of having autism, guys. And I never, ever, ever, ever wanted to upload one of those videos of me having an autism moment. But, you know, I thought I'd just, I thought I'd just upload it to show you guys what it's like when I have an autistic moment. And it's, it's scary, it is scary because like, what did I deserve to get this, this malfunction in my body? I can't even call it, it's like a disease. What did I deserve? What did I deserve when I was three years old to get this? Like, I've been like, it's like fucking ridiculous guys like i did nothing wrong like i was adopted i was put up i was put in foster care when i was like six days old i think like i was an innocent kid and then one day when I was three years old, I just started apparently attacking my parents for no reason. So they took me to the doctor and the doctor diagnosed me with um, autism. And although I don't do that now, guys, I was headbutting the wall. I was punching the wall. I broke my blimmin' knuckle for God's sake. Look just there. Look at that. Look at that mark. Look, let me tense it. Look, no knuckle shows there. I've broken two of my knuckles. That one and that one. Because I whacked the wall. Guys. I don't know what I deserved. I don't know why I decided to I don't know why I deserve this. I've got anger problems, I've got autism, I've got every fucking thing wrong with me. Why does my life go wrong all the time? I was adopted. I lost my father eight years ago on May the 1st. I'm never ever going to be able to meet my proper real father. Life just sucks for me, guys, because I don't, I didn't ever want to take us, but my real father walked out on my mum, who was 16 years old when she was pregnant with me she was 16 years old 
No, sorry, she had me when she was 16. She was like 15 and a half years old. She was my age right now when she got pregnant. So I'm never, ever, ever going to be able to go up to a man ever again and say, Hey, Dad, how are you? I'm never, ever going to be able to do that. And oh. I'm pissed. I'm just so. What did I deserve to have this happen to me? I know I've made some bad decisions. I know I've been arrested a couple times. I know that. I know that. And I'm, I'm not proud of it. Been arrested for shoplifting three times. I've been arrested for um, public nuisance about five times. Kim doesn't barely even know about this. I've been arrested once for assault. Altogether, in my 15 and a half years of being alive, I've been arrested like 12 times. But for some reason, I keep on getting away with it. I keep on not getting charged. So the assault, I should have really been charged with. Because for God's sakes, I gave that person a black eye and I broke their finger. But that's why you don't call me no fat bitch. <laughs> But yeah, no guys, um, I had an autistic moment, but I am now happy. And um, yeah, so that is it guys. Adrian, I am fine now. Peace out guys.